counting? Great question. Hey. Howdy. Uh, how, how are you doing? I'm doing fine. Have you been uh, doing the, uh, you know, the barrel races? Hi. How, how's that been going? Just as fine as it ever does, Wade. Uh, first place, huh? Hi. Does, uh, does my record still hold? Can't even remember, actually. You can't remember. Uh, you know. You always know these things. Hmm. Uh, uh, so, uh, how's work? You, you don't have to talk to me, Blade. No, I'm trying to. Okay, well, this is making bo to... both of us are intensely uncomfortable with this conversation. So I'm, I'm just I... telling you right now, you don't need to. I'm trying, trying to, to build it. a wooden bridge. I think that the foundations of that bridge have already been burned beyond repair. Wait. Are you fucking... What do you mean burnt beyond repair? Burnt re beyond repair? What are you talking about? You have always told me you can't give up on people. And now it's burnt beyond repair. I didn't give up on anyone. I just can see how things are. So uh, you know, you're not. I, I can't mend. I can't mend this. You know what? Stuff doesn't happen overnight, Wade, or in a week's absence. I didn't say. I was just. Trying to make some small talk. Okay, well, I, I don't really do small talk, Wade. But I guess you didn't even learn that about me. Right, right. I, you, you just gotta take shots at me and walk away. Why? Why? I have stuff I came here to do, Wade. Yeah, you just... You, I don't... <sighs> I got it. Sorry? Sure. Yeah. Okay. So I'll tell you what. You have two options. Okay. Actually, you want to know what? I will let Pavis do it. Says she's a senior deputy. All right, we got taken care of. I don't want to make the wrong call. I so yeah, feel bad for cash. But my answer would be. Yeah, my tip. What? So, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Say it again. What? The uh, the message I sent to the tip line. I. Uh, Cash got it sorted out, but I feel bad for him. He's oh. got a big line. I, I, I'm not gonna bother him. Yeah, I do. Let's go back to Blackwater. <sighs> Are you going back to Blackwater? So, uh, okay. I, yeah. I kind of have to. We have the whole department. I, Rip and I are going back to Blackwater, but I'm not sure how much longer I'll be on duty.
I'm not sure if I've got dust in my, my ears, you know. Hmm. Yeah, there was uh, quite a number of people there. There certainly was. You said you didn't plan on being on duty for long? No, I'm not sure. It's it's uh, it's pretty late for me now. And if there's nothing happening, and just uh, I'm sure you know, Boyd and Dusk are gonna come linger in Blackwater, or if it ends up being just standing around near Thorn in Blackwater. Mm. <sighs> Especially yeah, right with Boyd with acting the way that he's acting, as if nothing changed, as if nothing. <laughs> then again, he just thinks it can be fine. Well, it's not fine, Boyd. It's not fine. I'm sorry, I'm just having a wee vent here. No, no. no. I told you before, if you want to vent, you can vent. Nothing to be sorry for. I just don't want it to be the bad person here. But I feel like it's a wee bit much for him to expect that I'm just happy to make small talk with him. This soon. I don't know, I can. And then he yeah. and then when I don't want to, then he acts like I'm being terrible somehow. Sorry, didn't mean to cut you off. No, no, I, I was just gonna say, I don't know all the details. I know at one point uh, you two were together and that's obviously changed. <laughs> um, Aye. Aye, it's changed. If it is in, uh, you said uh, making small talk so soon. If, uh, if he's the one acting weird about it, then that's not on you. He just tried to make the most uncomfortable conversation ever and I held it up for a wee bit and then I said, you know, you don't have to do this. You don't need to talk to me. Because it sounds like he was forcing himself, you know? <laughs> don't get me wrong, I, uh, I know all too well of just giving someone distance and not wanting to talk with them. But, in a professional environment, sometimes you have to uh, put everything aside and. I, I should have. Really, what it is is I, sh I should have just declined him from the beginning. That's what that should have been. He had a pass, and he told me that he wanted to change that for me. And I said that if he was willing to change, I was willing to give him a chance because I, if there's anything that I believe in, it is redemption. And I'm very clear with that and I walk that out in my life. And he buried me, so. I only asked for him to be honest with me repeatedly. I left that door open. And to most people, it's going to look like he just uh, decided that he went to pursue me to help him get a badge because as soon as he had that badge he stopped talking to me pretty much and I started asking him and said you know if, if we want this to work we're gonna have to work for it and know how it is to get the badge and to not feel like you can put it down for any time off And I asked, is something changed or are we just working through this? What do you tell me? What do you tell me? And then suddenly, well, I've been seeing Dusk for a week. So maybe that's why I'm a wee bit hurt. Mm. I think at least act like he did something wrong. That it wouldn't hurt. Going up so to bad. your mistakes and mm -hmm. 
But it's more of like, if I'm being standoffish, then I'm the bad guy here. You're doing what you need to do for yourself. Nobody should try and fault you or villainify you for doing that. And that's not how it tends to work out, unfortunately. I've already, I mean, I've already met. It was, I was get it ended before it could go any further. Because I thought he was going to use the excuses that he had. Well, he's not going to be faithful in anything. I don't think it was a mistake for him to get his badge. And I would have still stood up for him if we weren't courting at the time. And that's all that matters. You said you've been burned? Why? Well, when uh, you're asking someone if something's changed and if there's something we need to talk about and finally you admit that they, they admit that they've been seeing someone else for a week. Aye, that's, that's getting burned. I guess I know the feeling, but on a, a different use of the word. Sorry, no. I just mean that I kept telling him I'm gonna trust him. I asked him about dust several times. I said, has something changed? He said, no, no, no. I left that door open for him. I said, alright, I'm gonna trust you. Because I'm not gonna nag you, I'm gonna trust you. Well, some folks, they need to be nagged, unfortunately. They don't understand what. Doing. Well, if I have to treat a man like a child, then he's not a man. 